This video covers the optional paddle mods in the Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War Pro Game Pack for Cronus Zen. We recommend that you have already watched the Game Pack setup video, and that you are following the order of our video playlist. This video leans heavily on information and settings that have already been covered in previous videos. Regardless of whether you are playing on PlayStation or Xbox, paddle mods require either an Xbox Elite Series 1 or Series 2 controller with completely unmapped paddles. You can unmap paddles using the Xbox Accessories app or with Zen Studio itself. In the Game Pack config menu, navigate over to the paddles. Paddle 3 is top left. Paddle 1 is top right. Paddle 4 is bottom left. Paddle 2 is bottom right. Enter the adjustment menu for the paddle that you would like to map a button to. Now choose the button that will be mapped to the paddle. Anytime a paddle mod is suspended or set to disabled, you will have access to this mapping feature. You can also find the adjustable settings for mods here, such as quickscope firing delay, aim assist intensity, and for any mods with the turbo name, the shared turbo speed setting. Back out of the adjustment menu. On to the paddle mods themselves. If more are added in the future, you can learn about them in the Game Packs manual or in future update videos. The current mods are as follows. Regular Fire. Use the paddle to fire your weapon normally. Rapid Fire. Hold the paddle to fire your semi-automatic weapon at its maximum speed. The Quickscope mods can help you to scope in and quickly pick off others with surprise sniper or tactical rifle shots. For Quickscope Tap, Quickly tap and release the paddle to automatically scope in and fire. To just scope in, hold the paddle. For quick scope release, hold the paddle to scope in and release to fire. To cancel firing, swap weapons. Spring loaded sidearm allows you to react quickly with secondary weapon fire. Hold the paddle to automatically swap to your other weapon and fire. Release the paddle to spring back to your previous weapon. Toggle aim. Tap the paddle to toggle automatic holding of the aim down sights button. Much of the remaining mods are paddle variants of the aim and shot mods. Hold the paddle to do as each mod name implies. Moving on to ADS aim assist. Hold the paddle to aim down sights while ensuring that the in-game aim assist mechanic does its best to reduce near misses and improve your aim. This mod shares all adjustable aim assist settings and information covered previously in the aim assist and aim assist calibration videos. Slide cancel. Easy slide canceling for players that have disabled their in-game auto sprint setting. While sprinting, hold the paddle to slide and then release the paddle to cancel your slide, getting you back into the fight quickly. Rapid crouch, jump, and melee mods. Hold the paddle to rapidly perform the action. Turbo Paddle. Hold the paddle to turbo the button that you have mapped to the paddle. This essentially allows you to create any adjustable turbo mod. Whichever mods and settings that you decide upon, don't forget to save and exit the Game Pack config menu. During gameplay, you can suspend a paddle mod to access the mapped paddle. While holding touchpad on PlayStation or View on Xbox, hold the paddle until you feel a rumble to suspend or resume the mod. You will feel a heavy rumble for suspended, or a light rumble for resumed. And that's how you use paddle mods in the Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War Pro Game Pack for Cronus Zen. If you enjoyed this video or found it to be helpful, drop us a like, subscribe, and hit that bell to stay tuned to Cronus Zen.